All right, I managed to upgrade a little bit the, the motion test uh, tool, utility, whatever you can call it. Uh, so, just added more sliders for all the axes possible. Um, plus now, uh, you can easily move on your one actuator, for example, or uh, just the other one. Or see, just the last one, for example. Click on it, go to the position. Or you can just grab all of it, all the four actuators, for example, the vertical ones to go up and down simultaneously. Or you can just grab all of it. Let's move all of them. And uh, you can deactivate the spike filter easily. Just hover the mouse over it. Square. It'll be all without spike filter. If you hover to the red cycle, it will activate the spike filter. And uh, you can see here, it won't let you do too much harsh motion. So, yeah. I think that will be useful if you want to put some actuators up, for example, but leave the rest centered or do some for repairs or whatever. So you can leave that running and uh, keep the motors activated or specific actuator to go to a position anyway get the idea uh, you'll find this on uh, github uh, so Thanks for watching.